one of your followers asked, what testosterone levels do you like to see in the guys you are working with? For now, there's great variability, and you know this. Yeah. Great variability in total and free testosterone. Let's talk about total. When we see a man with sub 500 total testosterone, 500 nanograms per deciliter, that's something we want to lean into and say, okay, what's going on? Are you 60 years old? Yeah. Okay. Are you 30? Ooh, big problem. 40, we can do better. And then we look in the lifestyle. All right. How much sleep are you getting? What's your stress like? What kind of food are you eating? Have we gotten comprehensive blood work yet? Is there any sort of deficiencies or imbalances? Like what are the, just the, the base areas first? Are you strength training? Are you kind of engaging in, you know, promising, you know, interpersonal relationships with your significant other? Like we look at that whole lifestyle spectrum first, we get the blood work and we see if we can start bumping. Usually we can. Usually we can bump 50, 100, we've gone up 300 points because some people's lives super stressed out at work, the relationship is suffering at home, they're just poisoning themselves with, with fast food every day, they're drinking too many whiskeys and beers, they're not exercising. We eliminate all that, we, you know, maybe you know, find out, hey, DHEA, pregnenolone, zinc, magnesium, iron, all a little bit low, vitamin D3s in the tank. We get them optimized and all of a sudden we see, hey, now you're doing great. You're 650, 700, like high five, dude, you're crushing it. But to the biggest point is how do you feel? And if someone's at like 480 and they're like, oh my God, I feel great. I'm chasing my wife around the kitchen every day. Like I'm crushing my workouts. It's like the strongest and leanest I've ever been. Hey man, sounds good. Like let's make sure we're doing all the stuff I just said, of course, Yeah. but you're probably good. But we get a lot of guys and usually what we find it, it's, this is arbitrary. But that 500 is kind of that, that you know, like test mark. And most of the guys below 500, they report, start reporting all those negative side effects. The guys above, usually it's more lifestyle tweaks that need to be done. But the blood work is huge for the medical intervention. And we see more men and women now that are dramatically transforming their life because no matter what they do, that number keeps declining. They're living perfectly over time. It keeps declining. And then the bioidentical hormone intervention comes in. Great practitioners like yourself are able to really walk that journey with the patient and give them their life back. I mean, we've seen like borderline divorces because there's such a clash inside the house, the sex appeal doesn't seem to be there, impatient, can't get good sleep, stressed out all the time, and that compounds over and over. Well, it turns out, well, there's a hormone imbalance that's been unaddressed by traditional medicine, and then someone like yourself, a high-level practitioner, is able to come in and make a little tweak, and all of a sudden, they're back to being 25 again. Love it.